Take me to India. India. For outsiders, it's a country of mystery, with an exotic culture and tradition of ancient wisdom we never encounter at home. Knowing it solely for its beaches, such as Goa and Kerala, where the hardest decision one will face is which side of your body you want to get a suntan, certainly doesn't do this magnificent place any justice. Once you look past the sun lounges and umbrellas, you will find the soaring Himalayas, scorching deserts, gushing waterfalls and vast lakes. Not to mention the majestic Ganges, exquisite architecture which has endured for millennia, and ancient, desolate caves. India is versatile, unpredictable and even crazy at times. Here, you will learn to take things at their own pace. For the soonest your train will come is usually a day behind schedule. You will learn to accept things as they are. You will realize that when bad things happen, it's not because life wants to bring you down, but instead in order to test what you're made of and teach you to be happy with the small things you have. Brightside guarantees that if you go to India, you will want to come back almost straight away. Taj Mahal, Agra, India. The largest tea plantation of India, in Munir. Nubra Valley is about 150 km to the north of the capital of Ladakh. The Buddha statue in Ladakh. The Rich Colors of India A Prayer on the Banks of the Ganges A hotel by the Piccola Lake. A view of Ace All, the capital of the Mizoram state. One of the beaches on the Andaman Islands. The Incredible Tree Root Bridge Holy, the Festival of Colors Traditional Wedding Mendy Painting Diwali, the Indian Festival of Light 